As the Matramani celebration continue across Guyana, several vendors are here in Georgetown playing their trade and enjoying the vibrant atmosphere. Today we will be hearing from some of those vendors and their experience and how they anticipate the Matramani celebrations. Well, so far the business has been hot. You know, the, the weather is nice. No rain today for the first year. And, um, you know, business is going good so far. Oh, we won't have enough ice. <laughs> we won't have enough ice. Um, this is our second order of ice for the morning. Yes, this is our, this is our second 200 pounds of ice. So we're hoping that throughout the rest of the day it's more. We're selling barbecue chicken. We have cranberry rice, cook-up rice, um, sauce, black pudding, white pudding. We're expecting to sold out today. Yeah, this year looks promising. Last year was rain, rain, rain. But this year, everything is nice. Today, this is going great so far. It's one tour, the tree, and we're doing really, really great. Just like come and see the name. Last in the sauce, people don't get embossed right now. It's like people got to test to how flavorful we think. If you taste it here today, you can't taste it nowhere else. So when you ask me here today, we ain't going to sell out just now. Okay, basically this far, business is now being picking up. Um, we expect, you know, a bit later on the place, the sun cooling a bit, a lot of people come out. So hopefully things would look up to bit. It's the first time for me and for now, it now start pick up. Maybe later down it might, you know, be nice, but not bad. In between, in between, you got to thank God for these small blessings. Over the years, Guyana has seen an influx of foreigners and Guyanese returning home for this specific celebration. As such, this has enabled the country's tourism sector to expand, allowing more businesses such as hotels and transportation services to benefit. Mm -hmm. 